here we have one of my first ever macrame project I created on this channel. And this is kind of like a faux macrame because you get the look of macrame without actually having to put in all the work needed. So I actually started off with this metal pot here. I believe I got this at Joanne Fabric and some macrame cord also from Joanne's. So what I wanted to do is first start off by creating a ring that would kind of go along the top rim of the pot. And we're going to be creating our macrame based off this ring here. So cutting a couple of yards of macrame cording, you're going to need two strands per section, fold them in half, and you're going to create a large head knot over that ring that you initially created to hold your pot and you're going to want to apply these at four different points on your ring there so as you can see we have four different sections applied and now you're going to want to start the macrame process so grab two strands and place them in the center and you're going to use your right strand go over the top of your two center strands your left strand is going to go over the top of your right's tail underneath and up through the loop this is going to be a very very repetitive process but this is why i kind of call it a faux macrame because there's no need to really connect different strands and get kind of confused as you're going on with the process. You're only going to be working on each four of these sections at a time, and you're going to be creating a sequence of square knots, which is going to end up looking something like this. And once you reach your desired length, go ahead and tie all four strands in a knot there and cut two of the strands off that are not necessary anymore. So you only have two hanging from the end of the knot there. And then once you finish it off, just go ahead and tie all your strands together at the top and hang wherever you desire. 